Good morning, everyone. I am Teacher Kirby, and welcome for today's another exciting lesson in astronomical phenomena before the advent of telescopes. But before anything else, let's enjoy watching this short video clip.
phases of the moon, solar eclipse, motion of stars, and visibility of planets. This time, I would like you all to participate in an energizer. Are you ready? I'll be giving you 5 seconds to guess the exact word. That's right! It's astronomy! How about this one? Very good! The word is phenomena! Guess this! Good job! It's Eclipse! I hope you had a great time participating in our Energizer. Now, let's be guided by the following objectives. The most essential learning competency or milk of this lesson is that the students shall be able to learn to cite examples of astronomical phenomena known to astronomers before the advent of telescopes. For the knowledge, describe each example of astronomical phenomena. For the skill, illustrate how astronomical phenomena take place through virtual presentation. Attitude, flexibility during the distant mode of learning in times of COVID-19 pandemic. Even before the advent of telescope, ancient people have already observed different astronomical phenomena. The most observable celestial objects in the sky back then are the stars, the sun, and the moon. Babylonian and Egyptian civilizations used a traditional version of a sundial called nomon in systematically observing the motion of the sun. By observing the shadows that the sundial casts, they were able to realize that the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. Also, they recorded that the points where the sun rises and sets on the horizon differ over a year, and these changes happen seasonally. They observed that these changes are related to weather and concluded that seasonal changes in climate happen during a course of one year. Babylonian astronomers developed zodiac signs. The sky is divided into three sets of 30 degrees and the group of stars that inhabit each sector. Constellation schemes are used for predicting and settings of the planets and lengths of daylight as measured by water clock, wherein time is measured by the regulated flow of liquid into and out from a vessel and where the amount is then measured and shadows. To better understand the concepts presented and discussed, let's have an activity. As you can see, we have different astronomical phenomena before the advent of telescopes. I want you to pick just one and describe how do the phenomenon takes place based on your personal experience and prior knowledge. I'll be giving you five minutes to perform the activity. Earth 
fully exposed to sunlight. The moon has phases because it orbits Earth, which causes the portion we see illuminated to change. The moon takes 27.3 days to orbit Earth, but the lunar phase cycle from new moon to new moon is 29.5 days. How does a solar eclipse take place? A phenomenon known as solar eclipse was also observed. Solar eclipse occurs when the moon is in between the sun and the earth and the moon is either partially or totally blocks out the sun, causing the moon to cast its shadow towards earth. How did the ancient people determine that there were motions of stars in the sky? It was also observed that the stars appeared to be attached to a celestial sphere that rotated around its axis in a day. The axis of the northern sky closely intercepts with the northern star known as Polaris. Also, the constellation's positions in the night sky changes depending on the time of the year. To better understand the concepts presented and discussed, please complete the table below. Comets Comets are also known as hairy or broom stars were also observed during the times without telescope. Comets are irregular phenomena since they were not always seen in the night sky. Moreover, from the observations of Brahe, comets follow a circular path between Venus and Mars. Meteor is a part of asteroid burning in the Earth's atmosphere. Meteors occur more frequently than comets. Observations and interpretations were just based on meteor showers here on Earth. So, prior to those, there were no further descriptions where recorded supernova. Supernova is a very bright star caused by an explosion. It was first observed by Brahe and was determined to be far beyond the Earth's atmosphere. Let me ask you, what do you think is the importance of knowing different astronomical phenomena before the advent of telescopes? They may provide some of the foundations on which an understanding of the deeper meaning of mythologies, religious systems, and even folk tales are based. These influences are reflected and may be detected in the archaeological material as well. The motions of the astronomical objects determine the day-night cycle, the seasons of the year, the tides, the timing of eclipses, and the visibility of comets and meteor showers. Easily observed astronomical events have formed the basis for timekeeping, navigation, and myths or sagas in culture around the world. To determine whether you have learned a lot in our lesson for today, let's have an evaluation. I'll be giving you five minutes to finish answering the evaluation. 